Lägg your hands to him. Shh. When I survey the wondrous cross on which the Prince of Glory died, my richest gain I count but loss and poor contempt on all my pride. Forbid it, Lord, that I should boast, safe in the death of Christ my God. Thank you, Lord. See from his head and his hands and his feet sorrow and love flow mingled down the cross. See from his head, Lord Jesus. See from his head, his hands and feet Sorrow and love flow mingled down. Did ever love and sorrow meet? Or have you ever seen composed so rich a crowd? And so we say today to you, Lord, when I survey the wondrous cross on which the Prince of Glory died, my richest gain I count but loss and poor contempt on all my pride. My Jesus, I love thee. I know thou art mine for thee all the follies of sin I reside. My gracious Redeemer, my Savior, art Thou, art Thou. If ever I love Thee, my Jesus tis. I loved thee in life. I will love thee in death. And praise thee as long as thou lendest me breath. And say, when the death do lies cold on my brow, my brow, if ever I love thee, my Jesus, tis now. Lift your hands to him. I love you. I love you, I love you, Lord, today, because, sing for me, come on, Jim, in such a blessed way, and yes, I praise you, I lift you up, I magnify your name, that's why my heart is
stand with eyes closed. Everyone standing, please. Everyone standing, please. Every eye closed. Make that commitment to Him. You sang it earlier, now in your heart say it to Him. I will not turn back, Lord. To whom shall I go? You have the words of life. You are my everything. You are my all. Just gently, Jim, please. Just heavenly sounds now. You are my everything. Yeah. Both great and small. You gave your life for me, made everything new. You are my everything. Lord, I love you. You are our everything. You are our all, all of us. You are our everything both great and small. You gave your life for every one of us, made everything new. You are our everything. Lord, we love you. Jesus. Jesus. Jesus, there is something about your name. Tell him, saints, you're my master, Savior, Jesus. Like the fragrance after the rain lift your hands and call his name Jesus out loud Jesus let all heaven let the earth proclaim and kings and kingdoms They'll all pass away, but there's something about your name. Kings and kingdoms, they'll all pass away, but there's something about Jesus, 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 there is something about your name, Master, Savior. Like the fragrance after the rain, lift his holy name, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Let all heaven, let the earth proclaim. Everything in the is come on, Jim and kings and kingdom and all pass away but there's something about Jesus you're the sweetest name I know and you're just the same as your lovely name that's the reason why we love you so. For 
so glorious preparing us your temple we are born as living stones where you're enthroned as you rose from death and power come rise within our worship rise upon our praise let the hand that saw you raise clothe us in your glory Draw us by your grace. You are Jesus, so glorious, preparing us your temple, born as living stones, where you're enthroned. As you rose 
from death in power. Come rise within our worship. Rise upon our praise. Let the hand that saw your race please clothe us in your glory. Draw us by your grace all oh, the glory of your presence of your presence we are temple give your reverence So rise to your rest and be blessed So glorious. Please prepare in us your temple, born as living stones, where you're enthroned as you rose from death in power. Come rise within our worship. Rise upon our praise. Let the hand that saw you rain clothe us in your glory. Draw us by your grace. Tell him. Oh, the glory of your presence. says, and I, John, I, John, was on the Isle of Patmos, and I turned to see the voice that spake to me, and I saw one 
standing in the midst of the candlesticks whose eyes were like fire who shone brighter than the sun whose hair was white like wool when I saw him I fell as one who was dead and he laid his hand upon me and said fear not John I'm the first and the last I'm the Alpha and the Omega. Our Savior. One of these days our eyes shall see Him. And our hearts will rejoice forever. Everywhere, showing hands together, but not in the aisles. Showing hands together, please. Clear the aisles, gentlemen. Ushers, ushers, no. I want no, no one in the aisles. Clear the aisles, please. Such a mighty presence of God here. 
Lift your hands to heaven above as you join them together. Oh, Jesus. Your word declares, and suddenly there came from heaven the sound of a mighty rushing wind. It filled the house. Let the same wind of the Holy Ghost come into this room now. Touch your people now. Touch! 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 Everyone lift your hands and pray out loud in the Holy Ghost. In the Holy Ghost. Join hands right here quickly. There's a mighty anointing here. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Clear the aisles. Clear the aisles. Clear the aisles. Clear the aisles. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Clear the house, please. Join hands right here, please. Receive it, 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 receive it. Receive it, receive it, receive it, receive the anointing, receive the anointing, receive the anointing, receive the Holy Ghost. Receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it. Receive the anointing. All the pastors, all the preachers, get down here now. All full-time ministers, get down here now quickly. Everyone in ministry, get down here quickly. God, dear God, dear God, dear God. Here goes, here goes, here goes, here goes, here goes, here goes, the anointing, the anointing, the anointing, the anointing, the anointing, the anointing of the Holy Ghost. Receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive the Holy Ghost, receive the power of God. So Joshua, come here quickly, please. Lift your hands and ask you for more. Much more. Much more than this. Let your fire, Lord.
let your fire, Lord. Come near me. Just receive the anointing. It's here. In our midst, he is here. Shh. Surely, the presence of the Lord is in this place. I can feel his mighty power and his grace. This is the time to lift your hands and ask him for the biggest request you have. Ask him for the biggest request. Give him the biggest request. Hold nothing back. Don't limit him. Don't limit him. Such a moment will not come this way again. What is your cry? What is your request? Said the king to Esther. I'll give you half of my kingdom. How much more will the king of kings, our heavenly father, say to us? cheap words then as Sarah surely didn't mean it to say to Esther I give you half of my kingdom but our wonderful heavenly father says to us it is my pleasure to give you the whole kingdom not just half the kingdom there were the empty words of Isaiah a king of a nation that no longer exists. But our king, our king says, it is my joy, my pleasure to give you the kingdom, all of it. And Jesus said, for the kingdom of God dwelleth within you. to ask him for one of these days you'll judge angels one of these days you will rule the world with him for the kingdom of this world shall be the kingdom of our God of his Christ forever and in Daniel it states and the kingdom shall be the saints for the saints of the most high shall possess the kingdom of this world. But it goes beyond this world. Much further than this world. It's an eternal kingdom he gives us for the asking. If 
If any man will come after me, let him deny himself. Take up his cross and follow. But what do we get, Lord? He that spared not his own son, but delivered him up for us, how shall he not also with him freely give us all things more than just a kingdom? No. The greatest thing, now, my brothers and sisters, thing is to inherit him he is our inheritance he is our inheritance and we are his to be one with him the one with the glasses that one There's a call on your life. There's a call on your life. I saw you last night. There's a blessed treasure inside of you. Shh. Use him, Lord. Shh. Please, shh. bring him closer. When I look into your holiness, when I gaze into your loveliness, use it, use it. Sanctify him unto your use. Don't let him lose not a moment of life world I give his life to you as he gives his life himself to you and I declare him to be your servant your soldier your vessel as he stands and blesses your servant Joshua Dad those around him. <sighs> Use him. Use him. These are men of honor. Men of honor who will honor you and serve the Lord faithfully. Lord, let them all be men and women of honor. We'll serve you faithfully, every one of them. Saints, what belongs to us is beyond the scripture. Young people, you sweet, wonderful people of God standing there, you young men and young women, what belongs to you is beyond comprehension or even explanation that God should dwell in you and you in him eternally that he will be your inheritance and you will be his inheritance that you and him will be one united forever there will not be two of you there will be one of you just one in the Lord the Bible says even today, he that is joined to the Lord is one spirit. Within your heart is the Son of God through his Holy Spirit. Now before that it was your spirit, but now it's the Holy Spirit. Your spirit is hiding in him. Because now we are hiding, we're hidden in Him. 
there's not two in our hearts. There's only one. He that's joined to the Lord is one spirit. The reason I'm calling you up is because I saw this man last night. And the Lord spoke to me about him. I don't even know his name. I think I know his. I think he told me. I'm not sure. No, not him. This man there. It's Daniel, isn't it? Yeah. I sanctify you, Daniel, for the Lord's use for the rest of your days. Every moment you live, every breath you take will be for his glory. You no longer belong to yourself or the world or your, even your own family. You are the Lord's treasure, the Lord's vessel, his own forever. His own forever. They are your own forever, Lord. They don't belong to themselves, nor the world, nor the natural families. They belong to you. Keep them as the apple of the eye. Hide them under the shadow of your wings. Protect them from the oppressors, their deadly enemies. For the rest of their life, let them live in that blessed secret place, your secret place. I pray no plague will come near them, not one. A thousand will fall at their side and ten thousand at their right hand. It will not come nigh them. With their eyes they'll behold. The reward of the wicked, they are yours. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow you, people of God, all the days of your life. And you'll dwell in the house of the Lord forever. And today I bless you. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May the Lord cause his face to shine upon your life and give you peace for the rest of your days, for the rest of your life. Now, Lord, I seal your blessings on their life, on their destiny in you, in Jesus' name. As I stood here tonight and I sensed his incredible sweet, tangible presence. I thought I had died and gone to heaven. I was gone. I was, something happened to me physically, mentally earlier. And as that, that anointing began to sweep over my soul and your soul earlier, God sent me here for more than just ministering his word. I can tell you by the Spirit, a new mantle is coming on your life. Yeah. Don't lose it. Don't let anyone steal it. How many of you tonight sensed something come upon you? I did. I felt something on my head earlier. I felt a, a blessed, powerful force over my head. Did any of you feel the same? Wave if you did. I believe God is placing on you a new mantle. Lift your hands and thank Him. Just audibly thank Him. And the Lord is going to use you in a mighty way. Here in Ghana, and beyond Ghana. 